Okay, this is a quick demo of how your app will work. The first page is user login. The customer will enter their email and password they created at sign up. If it's their first time in the app, they will need to create an account. They simply enter all their personal details, including name, email, phone, and a password. Best part about this is you can now use all this information for marketing purposes also. The final step of sign up is to put a valid credit card on file. This is the credit card that all orders will be charged to. Once they have created an account and logged in, they will be taken to the home page. The home page is very simple. There's two simple options. The first option is to view the menu. The menu pops up on screen and they can view. This is the same as it's done in person. When they are ready to order, they simply hit the place order button and a chat window pops up. Now this chat module is no different than ordering from a server or hostess in person. A staff member of the restaurant needs to be active on the app to receive the orders. The customer can simply text what they want or they can ask questions. If they don't wish to text, they can just hit this little phone icon up in the top corner and be connected to the staff member via a phone call inside the app. Now the final thing the chat module does really well is coordinating delivery. The user can share their current location in real time with just one click. From inside the chat module, the staff member can see the exact location of the customer and they can organize delivery. Okay, so that's all you need to extract customer data, set up stored payment, take orders via the chat module, and receive customer location. The final step of the process is charging the credit card on file. This happens via your Stripe dashboard. It's very simple. You just locate the customer via their name, email, or phone number. You can easily charge the amount of the order to the card and just hit submit. The card will then be charged and a receipt will automatically be emailed to the customer.